Slitta, why do you care? There's nothing to play for. Sports Live in the ATL here on this Tuesday. Uh, we got about, what, next Monday night, national championship. My Georgia Bulldogs, because I am a massive, diehard, loyal Georgia Bulldog fan. The best Georgia Utah Bulldog video maker on YouTube. And there's nobody better. Good afternoon. Good evening. Uh, coming up on Sunday. Yes, there is something for me. Now, if you're a diehard Atlanta Falcons fan and a diehard, and I'll use this term loosely just this, this brief time, New Orleans Saints fan, it's always a must win whenever the Falcons and the Saints play. Whenever the Poodats and the Falcons play, it's always a must game. Throw the records out the window. And when I see Falcon fans that tell me they don't care about the game because the playoffs are over, sometimes I have to question your loyalty. Are you really a Falcons fan? I personally want to win every game regardless, um, especially when it comes to the Pudats. But just look at, look at what we could do by winning this game on Sunday at the Benz. First of all, we get bragging rights for beating the Pudats. That's always a party in itself. When I was in New Orleans in 2015, we lost, but I partied. I went to Bourbon Street, everything. French Quarter, everything. I had a blast. Too bad we lost, though. Met 44th Legendary. Drove around town there. Went to their mall. Got bet welts by Pudat, baby. Bet welcher for life. Um, but we always have a blast. So we get the bragging rights for beating them. We get bragging rights for sweeping them because we already been up to New Orleans and beat them. I went a bet with Crimley, which is $100 on the sweep. I See, they see for me, and, oh, and we eliminate the Pudats from the playoffs. New Orleans needs to beat us and have the Rams beat San Francisco. So clearly, the lesser of two evils, uh, I want San Francisco to beat the Rams. Because I already know Kyle Shanahan's going to combust in the playoffs. That, that, that's what he's known for. So let's just say we do lose. Just make sure the Pudats don't get in. And But also, if you win New Orleans and San Fran loses, then Kyle Shanahan is eliminated from the playoffs. So it's going to be a win-win Sunday one way or another for Slitta. I mean, they're going to laugh at the choker for missing the playoffs. I believe if, if that's not the case, let me know in the comments and I'll retract it uh, tonight or tomorrow. But that's what I believe. One of these two teams will be eliminated on Sunday, the Pudats or Kyle Shanahan. So it's going to be a win-win situation for me. Plus, I get a chance to win $100 and laugh all offseason. Okay, so yes, it's, it's a must-win. It's definite. It's a playoff game for me. Well, I, I've heard throughout the years all the Falcons care about is beating the Pudats. No, we care about, at least this Falcon fan cares about winning the Super Bowl and beating the Pudats in the process. Pudat fans... You know, the funny thing is the Pudat fans, when they're on YouTube, when the Pudats are winning, all right, when the Pudats are winning, all they all they say to me is, we're going to win the Super Bowl, and all y'all care about is we beating us because we're your Super Bowl. But if the Pudats are losing, this is what they say. Well, as long as we beat the Falcons, I'll be all right. Talk about hypocritical. I'm not a hypocritical. I come on and say it. I want to win the Super Bowl, the division, go to the playoffs, win the Super Bowl, sweep you guys, and uh, win the ring. So, But we're not making the playoffs. It's our fourth straight year not making the playoffs and with the losing record. And that that, that sucks. I, I'm not used to it uh, in the Matt Ryan era. This is uncharted territory for me. That's why we need to take care of business on Sunday so I can get one last, one laugh, one last laugh at the Pudats, collect my money, bragging rights, and move on and fix this damn team and get back to the playoffs and win a Super Bowl. But like I said, it's gonna, it should, if unless my math is wrong, and I've never been the greatest mathematician, that I'm gonna laugh at somebody on Sunday. Let's just say the Saints beat the Falcons. Okay, great. You beat us, we split, you're in the playoffs, you're gonna lose. I'll laugh at Kyle Shanahan being eliminated. Okay? We beat you, then I'm gonna laugh at you guys not making the playoffs and getting swept by us. And then I think the Niners will, will get in if, you, if, if we beat y'all, regardless of what they do. And uh, then I'll see them 
losing the playoffs and laugh at them. So either way, it's going to be a great Sunday one way or another. I don't want to lose to the Poodats, but if it's a split, ah, so what? I'll go back and, and, and I'll just be happy at the moment, you know, because I'll, I'll, say, I'll say out loud, well, it sucks, but Kyle Shanahan, you didn't make the playoffs, you choker, and uh, Poodats, you're losing in the first round. So, or I get to see and laugh at you guys, Poodats, for not making it, us sweeping you. I get $100 and bragging rights all off season. And then I'll look at the Niners and say, well, Kyle Shanahan, congrats, but you'll choke in the playoffs. So you see, I get, I's got a lot. I's got a lot. So get ready, y'all. Sports live in the ATL. The champ. Hawks, 56 points by Trey Young. Half of our team back. 131 points, and you can't beat a 14 and 21 basketball team. With all that, that is it. the champ will see you in the next one.